We have seen record breaking heat this summer with the hottest June ever recorded in North America, but experts say the most dramatic temperature trend is actually happening at night. Our ABC 10 News anchor Derek Stahl is going in depth to explain how overnight temperatures can have major health impacts. June had plenty of scorching summer days. Across the country, more than 6,700 weather stations set new highs. But as the daylight fades, climate scientists say the bigger story emerges. This June set three times as many nighttime records as any June on record. Nighttime temperatures or minimum temperatures have been going up much faster than daytime temperatures over most of the world. Research meteorologist Alexander Gershinov says it's all a function of climate change. For more than a century, nighttime temps have been warming at nearly double the rate of days, according to the National Climate Assessment Report. Heat waves are not only becoming more frequent, uh, more intense and longer lasting like, like they are over most of the world, but they're also becoming more humid. Gershinov says that increasing humidity is what's driving our warmer nights. The moisture in the air acts like a blanket, trapping heat that would otherwise radiate back to space. And hot, humid weather at night is especially deadly. When it's humid, it's particularly dangerous for our body because our body needs to cool down. And one of the main mechanisms for our body to cool down is to so sweating. UC San Diego epidemiologist Tarek Benmarnia says sweat won't evaporate when it's humid, so it won't cool you off. But your body keeps trying anyway, working harder and harder, putting more stress on your heart. That's trouble for people with underlying conditions, all at a time when your body is supposed to be resting. When it's like people are in trouble during the night, typically when while they are sleeping, and if people are living by themselves, etc., a lot of issues can happen. A single heat wave can kill hundreds of Californians. And a study by Dr. Gershinov found that when temperatures rise, so do hospitalizations, increasing 14% along San Diego's coastline where air conditioning is scarce. So why are nights and days heating up at different rates? Experts say the answer has to do with pollution. During the day, pollution acts like an umbrella, blocking some of the sunlight from reaching the surface. But it doesn't have the same effect on temperatures at night. Derek Stahl, ABC 10 News. And those same experts say that warm nights are also a problem because countermeasures like public cooling zones are typically open only during the day.